Garbated. We found missing cats. A whole room of them. Dude, it scrambles one of them? Uh, negative. None of them are fat and old. Then what about the girl? We're still tracking her. We have to find out what she knows. Get going. We so close, I can smell it. Come on, back here. Could be a boss battle coming up. Better make sure you're stocked up on healing items and have your best artifacts equipped. That was a hell of a tip. them here, you stupid bitch? Uh-uh. Who are you calling a stupid bitch? Do I look like your mama? Let's get it up, Clappy! These kids are cops? That ain't no cop. That's Captain Diabetes. When he was born, his mom farted during labor and it gave him diabetes that he uses to fight crime. That is not how people get diabetes. If they aren't cops, then we can shoot them. Along with this bitch, too. Oh, shit. Y'all turning on me? I knew I shouldn't have went into business with y'all Tony Soprano-looking motherfuckers. So long, Captain Diabetes. Let's see your diabetes save you now. Uh-oh. Ah, what the? I want my keys. I don't have your keys, man. Ah. He's wasted on red wine. Red wine drunk is the worst drunk there is. Ah. Ah. Let's get the fuck out of here. All right, Captain. Diabetes, this is it. Give me my fucking keys. You are in no condition to drive. Then die. You're being unreasonable, Mr. March. Let me call your wife. Leave Sharon out of this, you little prick. My keys. Really good feeling about this, guys. Make way for King. I feel no pain. Punch someone for the coon, Fart Lord. Why you keep letting them hit you like that? Duck or something? Shit, shit, hang on, Sharon's texting me. Can't type, why the fuck can't I type? Why are my thumbs so big? Hey Siri, fucking take a note, tell my wife, fuck off, she's fighting, poop emoji. I'm gonna feel way better after this quick puke. Oh, hold on, you'll see. Little bitches hurt, baby. Oh shit, I'm still 
burning? trying to get new high-grade drugs out on the street. It's somebody trying to bring the Italians and Chinese crime families together and shit. And not small talk. Where is Scrambles? Scrambles? We need this reward money for our superhero franchise. Oh, shit. Y'all just want a cat? So then there's Cisco. He just some low-class asshole start working two months ago. He be talking all this shit about making money off the crime in the city because some big shot white boy be running all the drugs and all the hookers and shit, right? Okay. Uh-uh, but not me. I'm my own pimp, you know what I'm saying? It's like I got one investment in this world, and that's my pussy, and I ain't putting no mortgage on that to some high-paying nigga talking about trying to make more money off crime and shit. Classy, classy, I'm sorry, but what, what about the cat? Oh, that cat? Okay, that's this little Asian freak named Yakibaba or some shit like that. He going around paying all these little sixth graders to take people's cats. That's fucked up. I think taking that pussy and, like, taking mine, you know what I'm saying? That's like criminal shit. Where do the cats go? I can tell you, but I ain't saying shit until I know I'm safe, you understand? These niggas ain't playing, and I need to know you gonna protect my ass. Eric Cartman, do you have any idea what time it is? This is a school night. Mom, not now. We're seriously onto something. You kids all get home now, or I'm calling your parents. Sorry, Mrs. Cartman. Please don't tell my mom. And who is this stripper woman? These cone friends offer me protection. Well, she's not staying here. Fine, fast pass, take her to your house. Okay. <laughs> And now, the news program that starts your day off right. Good morning, South Park. Good morning, South Park. A new vigilante took to the streets last night and has apparently single-handedly taken down the Famboni crime family. Here with more is a midget in a bikini. Tom, I'm standing outside the Buca de Fagaccini where the vigilante declared war on crime in South Park. Security camera footage showed a young person farting in people's faces on their balls. It was just terrifying. The kid came in and just started farting on people. It was out of nowhere, man. Maybe someone's finally standing up to what's wrong with this city. This new kid's a hero. The kid's a menace, if you ask me. How long before he or she kills an innocent person? How long before Daredevil becomes the Punisher? Huh? Three seasons? Three seasons! Police called to the scene found a treasure trove of illegal items that they claim might tie the Italian restaurant to a larger crime syndicate. This may be just the tip of the iceberg. Certainly chilling stuff, and there are reports the vigilante possibly had a sidekick. There was thought to be a sidekick, Tom, but further investigation showed it was just some little twerp with diabetes. Thanks, Midget, and of course, the question on everyone's minds now. Who is the farting vigilante? This is going to make us look bad. You fucked up. It wasn't our fault. This kid just came into the restaurant and started farting like there was no tomorrow. All you Italians are supposed to do is move the product. The Chinese and Russians do the rest. Everything has to be discreet and quiet or people are going to learn the truth. That we put the product into people's drugs and alcohol in order to create more crime. You just keep doing your part in getting the cheese out on the streets. Or maybe I'll start dealing directly with the Russians. Or the Chinese. Or the sixth graders. Oh man, what a 
great sleep. Yeah, I haven't slept that well in weeks. Hmm. So, you guys do anything interesting last night? Oh, no, you know, the usual. Just watched some TV and went to bed. Yep, nothing exciting in our b boring lives. Well, then, I guess I'll just be seeing you guys tomorrow. You've got a big day ahead of you, new kid. Get changed into your superhero costume and wait for a message from the king. How'd you do that? That was dumb. All right, my lord. It's time for us to get the information we need from Classy. Any good superhero should know how to interrogate. Get over to Jimmy's house and find out what she knows. Keen out. <laughs> Need to get somewhere for that, 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 that quickly? Catch you later. That's a good fourthy. Come a little closer. Oh, is a little fourthy afraid? Poor bit. You again. Sup, hero? Don't be farting in my face and shit. Hey, Fast Pass, one of your super homies is here. Oh, hey, new kid. The coon told me he wants you to question the witness, so go ahead. Have at it. Go ahead, new kid. Ask her anything you want. Oh, that's smart. Using the silent treatment can really make a witness a antsy. All right, look, I know y'all need my help and shit, but I ain't talking to you. Go get my medication. Y your medication? Yeah, I can't think straight without my medication. You gotta go pick up my prescription, all right? Until you get my prescription, I ain't telling you little heroes fuck all nothing. Well, all right, fine. Looks like you got more work to do, new kid. But before you go back out in the world, I want to show you something that might help your crime fighting. Let's get up to my room. <laughs> all right, new kid. It's time to take your superpowers to the next level. Go ahead and stand in the DNA fibrillator. All right, new kid, just stand still and I'll talk you through this. Check out the new hero DNA slot I opened up for you. Stuff you insert here will make a big impact on your combat path, pa pa your combat path effectiveness. Pick the one that best suits your power loadout. Just keep in mind that a big damage boost may mean less health, or vice versa. Kind of like how steroids shrink your bobs. Or so I've read. All right, now you know what real power feels like. Pretty dang good. That should do it, new kid. Hope you have a grasp of it. Now get out there and kick some <laughs> booty.
starting crime fighter from TV. It's so wonderful seeing Jimmy making famous friends. I just have to get a picture with my son's famous friend. <gasps> Thanks, honey. See you on Coonstagram. Fart on any mobsters today? Let's do it. Thanks for helping Jimmy out. Good job. Your parents must be so proud. This could be the start of a beautiful friendship, but no freaky shit. 